For the first time in centuries, a green comet will streak through the sky on Earth. A comet that hasn't been observed on Earth for more than 400 years will soon be visible to those in the Northern Hemisphere. According to a report from the Associated Press, the uncommon green comet, known as Nishimura after the amateur Japanese astronomer who discovered it in mid-August, is roughly half a mile in size and will pass within 78 million miles of Earth on September 12. To have a chance of seeing Nishimura, people in the Northern Hemisphere must get up about 90 minutes before dawn and look north, about 10 degrees above the horizon, near the constellation Leo. As Nishimura approaches the sun, it will brighten and then become harder to see as it descends lower in the sky. The Associated Press was informed by Paul Chodas, the director of NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies, that anybody wishing to view the comet on September 12 should be ready. You really need a good pair of binoculars to pick it out, and you also need to know where to look, Chodas said. On September 17, Nishimura will pass closer to the Sun than Mercury and, if it does not disintegrate during its visits to the Sun, will leave the solar system. The comet, according to Chodas, is likely to survive its passage, and, if it does, it will be visible to observers in the Southern Hemisphere somewhere towards the end of September. The comet last came this near to Earth in the Northern Hemisphere 430 years ago, according to Italian astronomer Gianluca Massi, who founded the Virtual Telescope Project. He stated to the Associated Press that next week would be the last feasible chance to observe the comet. The comet looks amazing right now, with a long, highly structured tail, a joy to image with a telescope, he added. The article claims that considering the number of professional sky surveys that make use of strong ground telescopes, discoveries of this nature made by amateur astronomers are uncommon. <laughs>